Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This is Sally Hearts Jack 80 and it is a fabulous, terrific Tuesday. I hope you guys are having a great day doing what you love and loving what you do. There is the beautiful Princess Cadence and today I will be sharing with you my Tinkerbell. So I guess I should have called this Tinkerbell Tuesday. Because, of course, I do collect Tinkerbell. I gotta say, I don't know if there's anything Disney that I don't collect. But um, part of the reason why I got this Tinkerbell doll, it is made by Mattel. I think she came out in 1999 or 2000. I'm not really sure. Was because I love the cute, unique box that she came in. Of course, if you know the Peter Pan movie, which I'm sure everybody's seen it a million, cotillion, cabillion times, <laughs> um, this box is made after the lantern that Captain Hook traps Tinkerbell in, of course. But in this version, Tinkerbell's happy. You could see she's smiling inside. So I thought that was a pretty neat idea for Mattel to make the box um, like the little cute lantern. And it's adorable. So also, I love the Tinkerbell face. It's her own uh, face mold by Mattel. And I love the new hairstyle, the little blue ribbon in her hair, the long ponytail, the curly little piece of hair on the side. Uh, her wings are really nice. I love that they're made out of fabric. I do prefer the Disney Store version wings, though. They're kind of made out of the see-through plastic, and they're glittered. Those ones I prefer much better. They just look nicer to me. Um, her outfit is base the basic Tinkerbell outfit. It's really cute. She comes with this um, wand that has a duster at the end of it because sparkly pixie dust is included in the little round container down there, and you dip that little wand in there, and then you shake it about, and you have instant pixie dust. <laughs> and the front of the box says Walt Disney's Peter Pan, Tinkerbell, of course, and I love the back of the box and the inside, how it has a picture of the night sky. It's really, really nice. You could see up there by her wings, there's a faint outline of the moon in back. And the only thing that I will say is kind of odd about this doll that I don't really like, but I could learn to love, and I have, are the green tights they put on her for some reason, because, of course, Tinkerbell doesn't wear green tights. But the shoes are really cute. Excuse me, I like the slippers. I like the cute little puffy ball at the end. And the front of the box, of course, is made by Mattel, three and up. So let's turn it around. There's the sides. The sides of the box have a cute little peekaboo window so you could see her from the side. And here is the back. It says Walt Disney's Peter Pan Tinkerbell. Wand and pixie dust for you. It has a cute illustration of Tinkerbell up there flying away. And it demonstrates the glitter ball and the glitter wand. Instant pixie dust. It's almost like Tinkerbell is throwing the pixie dust on the wand and in the ball for us. So that way, we could always have pixie dust to throw around. <laughs> and I recommend that you don't do that unless you love to vacuum, like, every second of every day. <laughs> and, of course, you get a picture of the doll. She's flying. Um, she's flying over um, London. You could see the London Bridge down here. And I'm going to say that's Big Ben. I'm not sure. And the it says, she's the feisty pixie who captured the hearts of millions as she traveled through Neverland, spreading mischief and glee. Take flight with Tinkerbell on your own quest for fun and adventure. So uh, there we are. And I also love that the box is well detailed. Like, you get the top of the lantern, you get the holes cut out in it. So it looks like the um, light from inside is shining out of it. Um, you get the lock right here. It looks like it's on a hinge. And then I love that the hinges are on the side of the box. So, really, really cool. Love this doll. Um, great job, Mattel. Um, other than the um, really strange pink tights. I mean pink, sorry, you guys. Green tights. She is a really adorable Tinkerbell, Tinkerbell doll. And if you're ever on eBay and you run across her, I would totally recommend her. She is really cute. She's, if not, just for the box. Because um, I love the box. The box was a huge selling point for me. I think if she would have came in a strange black dress or it had been yellow, purple, green or whatever, I still would have got it. It just would have been a different kind of Tinkerbell doll. So I think she was about $12 when I bought her. 
Um, she wasn't too expensive at all, which I was pretty surprised about. So uh, there is my review for Tuesday, this Tinkerbell Tuesday. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I hope you love it. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you for making me part of your day. Please comment down below. Uh, tell me if you love Tinkerbell, who your favorite Peter Pan character is. I gotta say I love Wendy. But they don't make enough Wendy dolls. What's up with that? Like, I could totally have a couple hundred Wendy dolls right now if they made them. Okay, that's a little obsessive. Maybe not that much. But I do love Tinkerbell. She is really iconic, of course, for Peter Pan. So anyway, let me know what you guys think. I would love your feedback. Please thumbs up my video, favorite it, and share it with your family and your friends. I would be so grateful, and I would love that. And once again, continue to have a wonderful Tuesday. Remember, love your family, love your friends, but most importantly, love yourselves. Be kind, stay positive, and until we meet again, have a magical day. I love you guys. Bye-bye.